for World Telecommunications and Information Society Day, celebrated annually on May 17th, the Telecommunications Regulatory Commission launched a video competition geared towards everyone in the territory under the theme, Broadband, the Future of Innovation. With two categories, children ages 12 to 18 and adults ages 19 and above, all interested persons were able to join. Chief Executive Officer at the Telecommunications Regulatory Commission, Mr. Guy L. Malone, had this to say. From where I sit as CEO, I am honored to be part of this and to congratulate the winners um, for their hard work. In the children's category, twin brothers Kem and Kemron Williams also entered the competition and both placed. Here are the winning videos for the children category. On BI News today, there is a controversy of whether broadband will be the key solution to improve the future of students' education. Here's an inside view of the classroom. Good afternoon, class. Good afternoon, teacher. Did you guys study your notes on the general knowledge of the Virgin Islands? Yes. Are you sure? Yes. Okay. Well, if you did, you should be able to answer my short quiz. First question. Who was the first Chief Minister of the Virgin Islands? Yes, Thomas? Correct. Next question. Who was the first Premier of the Virgin Islands? Yes, Thomas? Correct. Next question. Who is the current Premier of the Virgin Islands? Yes, Thomas? Correct. And last question. Who is the current governor of the Virgin Islands? Yes, Thomas? His Excellency John Duffin. Correct. Charles? The late Honorable Lachlan Charles E. Stone. You are late. It appears that Rodman is the future of innovation. We now pass to a commercial break. Please don't worry. Once upon a time, there was a very slow internet. But then came the solution. Broadband basically means that the signal in one line can be split between telephone and internet, so users can use them simultaneously at much greater speeds. Broadband features are, it's easy to use, it is very secure, and the much greater speeds give you instant notifications. Whether you're checking your email or streaming a movie on Netflix, you want a service that can provide a smooth experience. When making your final decision, look for the broadband service that offers the best deals for the features you need. Interruptions in service are inconvenient. Find out the average uptime for your local broadband provider. If you already use these services, you might be able to save some money by signing up for a full package. Ask about special rates or introductory pricing. Broadband has connections all over. Helping to get you loaded faster. It's your turn now. Are you ready? Stop over at this site to learn more. Don't miss it. It's just a couple clicks away. Head on over. What are you waiting for?
In the adult category, first prize winner, Mr. Earl Hazel Jr., said that it was an interesting experience and he encourages more persons to join the competition next year. It was an interesting experience. I mean, the topic that we had, broadband, the future of innovation, was quite an interesting one. The research I did, um, it opened my eyes to the possibilities and opportunities we have in the BVI when it comes to broadband and internet, yeah. Do you have a background in videography or editing? Well, y yes. I am a, a self-taught. It's a passion of mine and it's also a hobby. So when the opportunity came up to do it, I jumped at it. And will you be entering next year now that we know that they will be hosting it again? I would like to. It's a good opportunity. At the same time, I would encourage other people with the same passion to enter because it's good experience. It's also a good networking experience. You get to meet people who have the same hobby and you know, get to grow your craft. Well, thank you, Mr. Hazel, and congrats again on your win. Thank you. Here are the winning videos for the adult category. What do you think about in the future? The innovation broadband can cause. Let's try. Oh, a new voice note. Danny, don't forget Beach today, and I know you forget to turn on your security system. Don't worry, dog. Don't worry about being too far away from anything. Keep connected and control all your devices. You can even secure your home from wherever you are. No bad or slow connections exist. What is message here saying? Oh yeah, beach today. I think I need new beach clothes though. Let me buy something real quick. Search beach pants. Search towel. Okay, I good to go. Package should be here any second now. Get anything you need in a few seconds. You don't have to miss out on the fun waiting for packages to process and arrive. The internet will be that fast. You can use high speed internet anywhere. Even take pictures underwater and send them instantly. Broadband, the future of innovation by Nadia Turnbull. Broadband and internet is becoming a staple. We can't live without it. We can't function without it. Okay, for my everyday living, I would say the internet is paramount. It basically fuels everything. I can't do much without the internet. We use it for communications in the office, 
we need it for like everything. I need to stay in contact with my friends. It, well, it's very important because of my professional, in my professional life, because like checking emails, um, making sure that the Wi-Fi is always on if you need to stream things live or have conference calls. It's very important um, to perform a job. Technology advances. Every two to three years, something is becoming obsolete. And it's the same with internet. This way we connect is evolving. It's just how it is evolving. Live streaming and video on demand is way reducing the need for satellite and cable and, and these types of services. So here in the Caribbean, What's going to put us in the forefront of technology and uh, allow us to compete with larger markets is to have faster internet. To have, I mean, in, the, in, a, in Aruba, they're pushing over 100 megabytes. And that significantly impacts their tourism product. The amount of things that you could do over the internet, the amount of innovations that that, that having fast internet, fast and reliable internet allows us um, to have um, is necessary for us to move our infrastructure out, to put infrastructures in place that will allow us to, to compete with the larger markets, to compete on a global scale. As we, the people of this earth, come one, through this vast network we call the internet. And as the connection that we use, this broadband grows and develops in our country, we are going to develop. Just imagine the possibilities. The TRC is appreciative of the support shown by the community and extends best wishes to all the participants. I uh, would love to con congratulate all the winners of this year's event. Um, we had a board meeting a couple of weeks ago and we actually sat down and revisited this event and I think for next year we really want to make it something more spectacular. Um, I think a few different categories we're actually going to look at. You know, you guys have done such really good work on the video, right? We really wanted to do something that would actually impact the community in a big way and show that we do have the talent here locally to do, uh, to do work on this level. So again, I would love to congratulate everybody. Thank you for coming and really do enjoy the rest of the day with us here. Thank you.